Hey everybody, welcome back to Aladdin time. Oh fuck. Alright, so... We are... Uh, I guess we're... I guess we should just finish up that place, because it... I don't know, my naming convention is weird, so... I feel like 100%ing this place. So it looks like I don't really have to get all the collectibles. The hourglass doesn't really matter, uh, which is a good thing, actually. Uh, I'm very, very happy about that. To deal with this one. Uh, we already know about that. Perspiration, no chance. This guy seems to be perspiring. You know, I never noticed that. Perspiration, ho hopefully not. It's giving me like the, the fucking weather. Cheating the race. Alright, well, let's just go to some random one. Uh, because we just want to look at where the, um... Well, we want to find the little time portal thing above, so... So I'll just, uh, I'll just skip the intro here, because uh, we've seen it several times. At least 12. At least 12. Uh, I'm trying to remember where it was. Gotta ride the little fucking scooter. Anyways, uh, yeah, hey, welcome back, guys. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm having a lot of fun with this, so we're, we're gonna fucking... We're gonna finish this entire game, hopefully. And I am completely lost as I do not know where I'm going. Looks like I could just scooter around. Alright. Well, um... I think I've officially done a loop. I was looking for... I think it's where the beach is. I'm trying to think of where it is. So there's an underground place, right? And it has... Well, we, we saw it in the picture, right? Uh, it's the underground place, and uh... The nice, uh, the nice man told us that, uh, to stay the hell away from there. And so we did what he said. Because we always respect our elders in, in this game. I don't know. Just try to think of where it is. Because this, uh, place doesn't actually change overly a lot. So yeah, I don't think I've ever talked to this guy. Mafia see owl with science code. Mafia ask, you make science? Owl say words Mafia no understand. Mafia punch confusing owl. A, a science owl uh, is a reference to something. I think it's around here. Uh, try to remember. We're probably not straight in here. No, because we were already here. This is the mission where uh, I take forever to, to find stuff. Say mafia stupid, but mafia not stupid. Mafia graduate university. Mafia has PhD in mafia. <laughs> you know, someone's complaining like, "Oh, this is mafia way too much," and uh, and then it does that. Uh, it's for the green one. I remember at some point I was trying to do this. Oh, there it is. Okay, we could go open it, actually. Fuck it. Okay, apparently not. Because that one requires four. Oh, there's a fourth one. I remember this one I was trying to do at one point, but uh, we didn't do it, so... Okay, how many does this one need? Six? What am I, made of green uh, thingamabobs? I mean, I, I, I know the thing is right up here where I actually... Oh, actually, it tells me where it is? Oh, alright. Well, I'm sure I'll get some hateful comments about that. <laughs> hey, you know what? I, I, I figured it out actually pretty early on that it does that. So, you know what? You guys... are wrong. Oh, it gives me a token. Okay, so it's in instead of doing what I'm supposed to, I actually now want to go to the blue one since I know that's actually a thing now. So th these give me the coins. So these are the collectibles. So it's like in in the in the f in the fact that it's like um, 
It's not really a collectathon per se. It can be if you want it to be, it seems. Oh, we did this one already. Well, I mean, it's an easy way back to the top, actually. So, I mean, I can't really complain. So maybe there's something to that um, thing. I don't know, let me see. Oh yeah, it actually, when you touch it, it shows you where they all are. Alright, well, we'll just do that then. Alright, you know what, that's, uh... Um, as a, as a crappy gamer, uh, I, I thank you for that. Because it did that with a golden vault, but I, thought, I, I honestly thought it was just a trade of the golden vaults. I didn't think it was actually a... I, I didn't think it was something that uh, I had to basically worry too much about. Uh, I think it's just up here. Alright, it's probably somewhere here. Because I know I was like pointing somewhere here. Alright, we'll, 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 find, we'll, we'll touch the vault again. Alright, well, we learned something. As I said, like, I don't know, don't give me shit. I told you I, I, told you I, I didn't play this game, and, uh... These things are, uh... Oh, it's right up there, I see. I mean, it's, it's just part of learning the game. Sometimes, uh, you don't know... Uh, certain things, and, uh, whatever. I'm not, I don't know why I'm even excusing myself. I don't, or feeling bad. I already get. Uh, yeah, that's what I thought. It's just a piece of yarn. So, do the... I guess the yarn doesn't respawn, is my assumption. Because if it did respawn, then, uh... Like, you'd have to get it every time, or something. I don't know. Alright, well... Let's, uh, make some progression. Oh, let me up here. Uh, does the color palette piss anyone else off? Kind of does for me. Looks weird. It's like a shitty reskin. Kind of. I might, I might change, I might remove it actually. I mean, the, the Yoshi meme is is long dead. All right, let's go in. Oh, she has a cookie. Well, this is definitely some Mario Sunshine shit. I actually never beat Mario Sunshine. I actually never really even played it. I just watched someone else play it once. It looked it looked really difficult to control. Oh, okay, cool. I lo I didn't get my dash. Let's deal with this. Okay, all right. I uh, can't say I expected that. Yeah, I can tell the developers were big fans. Oh, there's a cookie, and it wanted to die. Oh, this is why you never trust cookies, guys. What has a cookie ever done for me, I asked. Alright. Oh. Shit. Oh no! Fuck! Alright. <laughs> the angle, man. The angle got me. Uh, how the hell am I, I... I can't even see a shadow on that thing. Does it have like a shadow there? I don't think so. That makes it incredibly difficult to tell where it is. Okay. I, I, I managed it somehow. Alright. We RNG'd it. Well, at least we didn't have to, like, start from the beginning or something weird. The game was pretty forgiving. Hat flare. Uh, do I want to look like a chicken? I don't think so. Do I... It really wants me to look like a chicken. If I get a chicken a third time, I swear to god. Alright. We get a new color. Yeah, sure. Let's just put that on. Because I, I just said, like, how I didn't like the green. The game either was uh, taunting me and saying I was chickening out of the green or uh, or something else. Alright, well that guy's done with. 
Oh, what the hell? Oh, wow, I look like I fresh off Tumblr, guys. Pink hair and everything. All right. Sure, we'll, we'll use we'll use a Tumblr color scheme for one, one mission. All right, cheating the race. You won't be able to... You're missing a key, key item and won't be able to complete this act. Okay, so it's warning me I need something, actually. So I actually need to just get out of this, actually. Well, I because I, we know that there's some power-ups that I haven't actually used. Ah, uh, yeah, so. So, well, I haven't seen them yet. So this is 14. So I think this is the second thing that I unlocked. So we'll, we'll go down here now. And, and actually make some reasonable progression. I can't get over this color scheme. It actually looks atrocious. Is this how you actually look? What the fuck? Okay, maybe all the color schemes suck. Nah, I don't know. <laughs> It was the- it was actually the pink hair I hated. Literally Tumblr. Fuck. Let me go up here. Your bleeding edge top of the line audio device. Without it, you wouldn't be able to tune into all your favorite radio broadcasts like Acquaintances at the Table, Goodbye from Sunshine Town, or Two Brothers, and a third additional brother myself. I... Don't know. Ah uh, yes, the VS VGS one, the fastest, most complex super supercomputer ever built. Ah, uh, cloud computing. Oh yeah, sure. Play Halo. Uh, <laughs> uh you powered a, a world of computing delight awaits you. Greetings, you undefined user. Welcome to your home computing experience. Open application. Fun internet or shut down. All right, well let's uh, go on the internet. Um, okay, search the internet. Thank you. Uh. I gotta search for my own myself. Searching. Zero results found from my cloud. You search it. What? Federal Review? Uh, I don't, I don't want to know the. I don't want the feds to know I'm looking at myself. Okay, yeah, let's search for something else. Uh, how about how about something nice like? How about like, fun? Right, why is everything zero results? Surely there was something for search. Well, fucking what it. Yeah, you know, if if the reporting to the feds thing works as well as a search, I'm not worried at all. All right, surf the web. All right, web surf application. Unfortunately, the tide is low right now. Please check me later. Ah ha ha! Very funny. All right. Well, let's 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 do fun. All right, let's play some games. Text-based entertainment application. Sure. I will choose a game from my immeasurable library of purely non-visual fun. I selected Corgi Quest Seven: The Leashes That Bind. You are Corgi. Your name is Alan. You must sever the magical leash that holding you to this plane of nastiness. Exits are north, east, and south. All right. Well, let's go north. Uh, there's a tiger. Exits are south, and it's advisable. Bark. You bark. It is very loud and good. The tiger is unduly startled and mauls you quite badly. Try again. Yeah. All right. Well, let's go north again. Let's talk to the tiger. Your attempts to just sway the tiger. The conflict he uh, he, he has seen. At the pause of your kind, of given him strength that of such weight that your words are negligible. He mauls you very badly. Try again. Damn. All right. Well, I guess we have to. Actually, what happens when we fight the the tiger? You battle the tiger with your claws. It's no match for your skill. Tigers are and will continue to be very endangered. You'll you'll be very tired for your crimes. Try again. All right. Well, it doesn't go. You don't go very far. All right. What's east? You cannot actually go east. You have been tricked. This, you are where your quest began. All right, well, fine, go south. You are south. There are a set of gates south. They are guarded by a prismatic wolf. Uh, exits are north. All right, well, let's look at it. There's a set of big gates. They are guarded by an impatient-looking prismatic wolf. All right, well, bark at him. You bark. It is really quite sonorous. The prismatic wolf rapidly shifts between spectrums of visible and in in invisible. You're a dog, so you only really see two colors regardless, so whatever, I guess. It flees and the gates are now unguarded. It would probably come back if you left, though. <laughs> Alright, we go, let's go south again. You go through the gates and arrive at a grassy clearing. There is a large canyon here. Exits are north and south. Um, let's jump? Try to jump the canyon. It's possible you didn't know how big canyons are. <laughs> Maybe that wasn't appropriately described. It, it was a very large and measurably deep... You possess immense, uh, 
mean, you should, you, <laughs> should you be uh, possessed of means to try, try again? Yeah, sure. All right, we have to go south. Right, let's see again. So what happens if we just look at the, the, the canyon? A uh, slightly dry grass clearing, a large sweeping canyon separates it from another gra grass clearing to the west. There's a character in that clearing. His name is Seven Conclusions. Jump to conclusions. Nice. You attempt to jump to conclusions, but instead make a hasty judgment without considering the facts. You plummet into the canyon for several seconds before Seven levitates you out and on, on their side. Seven is a wizard. You're on the other side of the canyon. Seven concludes is here. Uh, dressed very badly, as wizards often are, but the, there's a wizard's tower to the south, but it doesn't belong to them. There's... There's. They look both <laughs> incorrect in capital letters. It is on the, the plane of the yellow. Exits are south. You could go east, but that would be swiftly followed by down. Okay, it's talk seven. Make dog noise at seven. They understand completely. The nearby wizards would like to uh, would like very likely have a way to remove that leash. They say. It's not much else you could do here. Otherwise, uh, they continue. It's pretty sparse out here. All right, go south or right, have a look. There's a big king like four or five steps away. Also a large something wizard's tower to the south. If you went towards it, you'd be traveling tower towerwards. Seven is here too. Trust like a concept of <laughs> choosing clothes that look nice together uh, was an arcade secret far beyond their grasp. Uh, uh, what that? Uh, <laughs> sorry, choosing clothes that uh, look nice together was an arcane secret uh, far beyond their grasp. Exits are south, tower wards towards the towers, protected by wards. Alright, let's go south. You arrive at the tower, there are wards protecting it, and the, and boy, are they doing it, that in a passable manner. Seven is here as they followed you. There's much going on, they say. Exits are north. Alright, let's talk to him. You dog noise in a way that suggests that Seven should dispel the magical wards for you. They do it. It's anticlimactic. <laughs> Enter the tower. You enter the tower, it's air, <laughs> airy and well lit, but... Uh, that just makes it more uh, obvious that the, it's furnitureless and handpicked uh, furnishing. Um, the furniture is less uh, handpicked furnishing and more a collection of needed objects that someone came <laughs> to own as they became necessary. You know what I mean? Uh, you know what I mean? They kind of match. An effort was made to pick similar darkness of woods, but the styles are completely dissimilar. You can easily tell from the wear and tear that some of it been in use longer, though that the brackets uh, holding the longer shelf on the, wall, shelf on the wall are brass, uh, whereas most of uh, the other metal trimming pieces are iron. Why do we care so much about this? Someone has been knocked unconscious by a uh, bugbear while you looked at the furniture. Exists are not available, given that you're like in a fight. Use sword? Alright. You wield your sword for dogs in a manner which you are accustomed. Well, which actually, you, you, you know how dogs use swords, right? I don't even need to describe it. You, you slay the bugbear. The stairs, which do not mask any of the other woodwork, are unguarded. Seven is on the uh, is on the floor, but they are probably fine. All right, go up. You go up the stairs all the way to the top of the tower. There is an altar and a magic book. Exits are down in varying speeds depending upon if you go <laughs> direction first. Right, let's look first. They look literally hard at literally two things that are here. The altar looks like the regular kind, but not the bad cult kind. The book feels pretty magical, but you can't read, so what? <laughs> in what way is it magical, you can't really tell. Uh, you sure wish Seven was here. A <laughs> real trooper, that Seven. Reliable. Go Dennis? Alright, let's go Dennis. You focus your inner spirit and take in the magical energies of the book and the altar before speaking the word of power. Power. Power is the word of power. You feel tangible, uh, feel tangible's reality slip away. In an instant, you are pushed Denny, Denny, Dennis ways. You arrive in. Thank you for playing the special demo of Corgi Quest 7. The leashes that bind. Oh, yeah, it was a demo version. Well, that was disappointing. Holy shit, we spent like fucking ten, 20 minutes here. Alright, what, what other fun things do we have? Earth. You have selected the Earth application. Earth, the greatest mystery of our time. Many academies uh, subscribe to the theory that Earth does not exist. This theory is supported by the fact it's it's really improbable, and that's ju uh, just where science is right now. Giving further credible 
uh, credit, credence to this theory is, by all, all accounts, nobody can claim to have ever discovered Earth. The only record of people supposedly being born there or being told that it's real. The prevailing theory is that Earth is a mass shared hallucination and we should uh, just take things slow for a while and calm down and see if it goes away. Closing Earth application. Alright. Shutting down. I guess we can't do anything else there. Hey there! We're the Express Band, just a bunch of owls that got together to play music while riding the conductor's Owl Express. Is it okay if we practice here? In exchange, if you have any song requests, we'll be happy to play whatever you have in mind. Want to swap out some of the music you hear in the different chapters? Or want to hear us practice? Uh, what do we do with this? I don't, I don't know how to get out of this. Oh, right click. So I guess that's the music remixes that we saw earlier. This lever does literally nothing at all, but I'll try how bright uh, the nearby panel is when the power is on. It's stuck on really bright, actually, uh, so it doesn't even work. Well, actually, we can go in here, can't we? Uh, where is that? Alright, yeah. Oh, we have more of this shit. Oh. Oh, it's another one of these things. Oh, we have nothing for that, so... Oh, it's a time thing. Oh, you know, we ain't got time for that. I, you know, we spent, like, literally forever... Uh, with that text adventure, which, by the way, was the best part. I do like how they incorporated this. This is really fucking cool. Alright, this looks slightly more difficult. Well, there's some things to do here. Uh, oh, okay, well, that doesn't quite work. I didn't quite think that went through, honestly. Am I missing something? Maybe I have to go the other way? Or is there a... It's not a ledge I can go on, I think. I think I have to try and go the other way around? Oh, no, 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 I can, I can just jump around it. What am I talking about? Let's go like this. Okay, well... I can kind of see what the solution there is. Well, it should be, like, much simpler than I'm thinking right now. I mean, I don't think it's a matter of, like, going back in here. I mean, it might actually be. Okay, you know what? Whatever. Took me a second, but, uh, I figured it out. <laughs> uh, well, here's the problem. We, we died, like, twice, so... Oh, no, we got our health back. Never mind. The game figured out would be a casual. Good stuff. Ooh, okay. Oh, what the heck? I have a kiss button? Just, just in case you ever wanted one, I had a, number four is your kiss button. I'm actually kind of curious to know what that, that actually means in the bindings. Actually, wait. Sure, we can do this. Alright. You know, I think I think that's what uh I guess what Gears of War always was missing. It's uh, a kiss button. Make a much better game. Alright, well What the hell is this shit? <laughs> Uh, hey. Um. Are, are you friends? I'm gonna take that as a no, but also I'm gonna assume that I maybe need to jump on them. Oh. Okay. Well, they're enemies I've never seen before. Oh, there we go. Alright. 
Almost there, fellas. Oh. Okay, it's probably not doing anything like that. Alright. Oh, we did it. We figured it out. Oh, yes. My favorite time. New color. I uh, don't know. Half flare. Okay, that looks, that looks fucking steampunk as fuck. We'll do that. Alright. We'll put that one on. That, that, that hat looks baller. Especially since I always have the sprint hat on. Then uh, now we have like a, a, a good looking sprint hat. All right, what, what is it with this room that it wants me to keep going back for? All right, well, can't do anything here. That's adorable, actually. All right, well, I think we're good here, so... There is more shit to do here, but we'll do that for next time. Uh, so we're gonna go into, like, Doctor Who's fucking... Uh, telephone booth or whatever the hell. All right, bye guys.